100 gigabytes. It's fake. Let's make it genuine again. First, do a right read test of the USB. Carefully select the fake USB. Because all files on the chosen drive will be erased. A linear test will determine the true writable space on the disk. This can take up to 30 minutes or more. Once an integrity error is encountered, we can find out the true space of the drive. In this case, only about 8% of the drive is true space. Using disk part, we will now divide the USB to its true space. First, we need to identify the USB drive and select it. Make sure to see it selected in the list of disks. The asterisk indicates that it is selected. Once it is cleaned, all files and partitions are deleted. Now we will create a partition based on the scan result we have. Instead of the fake 125 gigabytes, we now have 9 gigabytes of true writable space. This will make sure all files written to the USB is not corrupt. Set the new partition to active. So we can format it normally. Now the fake USB is genuine again. 